Welcome you, it's Lisa Dehart here, Three Minutes with a Main Guide. I'm going to do a part two on paddles with canoe gear because after all, what's more important canoe gear than the paddle? So I had some questions about how to size a paddle. Uh, you want to put it on the ground. If you're in the stern, you want to put it up to your face and have it come somewhere between the middle of your forehead and your eyebrows. If you're in the bow, it's going to be shorter. You're going to put it on the ground. You're going to put you put it up to your face and it's going to come somewhere between your chin and your upper lip. There's always a little bit of wiggle room. So I want to take just a minute and go over the parts of my paddle. Um, this is a leather sleeve that I custom on all my paddles. It's not a grip, like I mentioned in the last video. My hand doesn't go there. That is to keep it, uh, the paddle, protect the paddle from running along the gunnel of the canoe, which is how I paddle. Uh, this is called a main guide grip. This is tradition. Um, on the long days, it's really nice to be able to move your hand all along this grip. And I know it looks a little odd, but um, it's very comfortable. The other thing that this does is because you can choke down on it, if you do start to get a little fatigued, this will pull this hand below your heart and you and you will use less energy. It's less, it's less work. Um, like I said, uh, John Porter made these paddles, but another fine, fine paddle maker for a solid ash paddle is Sean Tenney Paddles or an Omain. They've only been doing it 167 years. Sean Tenney Paddles or an Omain. The other thing I'll say is this is an otter blade and this is a traditional beaver blade. And I'll show you the difference there, just with the thicknesses. Hope you can see that. Now, I will tell you, it took me 30 years to try an otter blade. If I had my druthers, I would have tried it 10, 15 years ago. This I really like. So main guide, John Meter, who's the editor on Three Minutes with the Main Guide, in my last paddle segment pointed out that I haven't split an ash paddle because I pull the rapids. I don't paddle them. And he's right. I haven't paddled a rapid in close to 30 years. So um, full disclosure, there's that. So thanks to John Meter for keeping me honest. Um, we are going to do a live stream, a live feed. The thing where you answer questions and you tell guide stories, okay? We're going to try to do that sometime after May 8th. So stay tuned for three minutes with the main guide. And we're going to take a half an hour, like 10 times three minutes with the main guide. You know, um, I'm Lisa Dehart. You've just spent three minutes with the main guide.